Hey guys, it's Gomez Delmer again, and welcome back to my channel. So first of all, thank you again for joining today. I really appreciate your time. I also wanted to ask you, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, to please do so by just clicking on the button below and hitting subscribe because it's really gonna help me in bringing you a lot more content. Today I'm pretty excited and I wanna talk about another casual conversation, just like the one that I did on, the, on my previous video. We talked about, you know, the power of having habits, how we need to be consistent, and then making sure, you know, that you can handle your daily life with your family, and, and that's something that I that is great, that makes sure that you, you follow the advice that I provided you in that video. And in this video, what I wanna focus on is in a couple of things. One of them, it's gonna be how we can build habits, why waking up at 4 a.m. it's going to basically change the way that you work, how productive you're gonna be. And that's something that I've been doing. I've been doing that for the last three weeks and I've been posting in social media about waking up at 4 a.m. and and at the beginning, it was, like I said in the previous video, it was really, really difficult to wake up that early. I would just look at the clock, look at the time, and then, you know, just pull my phone up and then just go back to bed. And, and it was really difficult at the very beginning. I would do it one day and then two days. And then I started thinking about, you know, what I want to do long term and, and writing down some ideas, some projects that I want to work on, how I want to grow the community in YouTube. And basically what I want to see myself doing, you know, three to five years from now, 10 years from now. And, and those are some of the reasons that I've been able to, you know, to get out of it so early and just work on so many projects. And I started creating more than 20 to 30 repos in GitHub, providing source code to the community and basically, you know, pushing out videos and, and just doing a lot of things that I, I think one of the main reasons why not only waking up early has has helped me, but also finding, you know, my why. Why is it that I'm doing what I'm doing? And, and one of the main reasons is because I'm, I'm hearing people, you know, getting excited about the content that I'm providing. They're getting excited about the code that they're downloading. So, so that's the kind of thing that you have to balance and make sure that, okay, you gotta find the reason why is it that you wanna wake up so early. One could be, yeah, it, you're gonna be more productive. And, and I think that's one of the ones that, that are given. We're gonna be more productive if we wake up early. But at the same time, you gotta find out why is the reason that you wanna wake up so early? How do you wanna see yourself in a few years if you're working on a game and you're currently struggling from you know, working, working so hard and you might be the one that is staying up, all, uh, staying up all night working on a game. And I was one of those. I was working late hours until three to 4 a.m. And then I realized that I just couldn't do that because I had a day job in the morning and it made it really difficult. I was always tired. I wasn't as energetic, so I tried to change things a bit. I was able to release my games, I was able to release apps, and, and that worked, but I don't think it was gonna be sustainable over time where I could just do that over and over and over because you know, I would go to my day job in the morning and, and I would just be super tired, and yeah, I was pushing, I was, I was productive, but it wasn't the best, it wasn't the best me. Like, I wanted to be productive, I wanted to be, I wanted to be you know, in a better shape, I wanted to be exercising, I wanted to be very happy and excited when I'm playing with my kids. But if you're tired, those are things that are gonna be really hard to do. So waking up at 4 a.m. in the morning has a lot of benefits. I've been able to do, you know, I wake up about 3.45, 3.40, sometimes at 4. And by 4.50, I'm already done exercising. I come back home, I get ready, I, I work. I already thought about some of the things that I'm gonna be doing. So by, four, by about 5 a.m. in the morning, I already work and have so much done than you know otherwise i wouldn't not only that but i, I also worked out and that's some of the things that are important for me is, is you know exercising staying healthy and, and being active because i've been doing that for so many years so those are the things that you gotta find out what you know that are important to you if you know if, if certain thing is important to you make sure that you do it early in the morning mornings are great I, you know i get a breakfast in the morning i'm super energetic so there's just a lot of benefits. I, I'm done by, you know, about 7.30 with everything that I'm doing and get ready. I go to my day job and then I just cycle through that process and, and it's just been very, very great. Like I've been able to get a lot more people in the community. I've been able to push out more code. I'm super active, like I say, throughout the day. So make sure that you're looking at, you know, looking at those things. I, I, I just really love w waking up early and, and that's really what I wanted to talk about in this video is that if you're finding you know, struggles through work through your projects, but your schedule is not quite right, you might be going to bed late or you don't have enough time, look at your, you know, you can look at your time, look at your schedule, find out 
you know, what works for you. And I'm not saying that you need to wake up at four in the morning every day, but I'm saying, you know, if you, right now, if you're doing it at seven, maybe go back at 6.30 and spend, you know, 30 minutes of your time working on your dreams on things that you want to bring into reality because I think that's what we're here for and that's what I want to do. I want, I have dreams that I want to bring into reality. So it's going to be difficult at the beginning. I have to do some changes that are going to become habits. And, and that's what I'm finding is I make small changes and then over time I'm seeing, you know, I'm, I'm basically seeing progress and I'm basically getting more excited. So that's really what I wanted to leave you with. It's just, you know, keep working on it. Make sure that you're consistent. Make sure that you're building habits. And then, you know, look at your time because that's really important. Thank you very much, guys.